Looking for fun activities to do with your dog this summer? You've come to the right place. As the days grow longer and the weather warms up, it's the perfect time to bond with our four-legged companions. Whether you're a fan of the great outdoors or prefer the comfort of your own backyard, there's a multitude of ways to engage and entertain your pet. So, let's dive in and make this summer one to remember. Stay tuned as we count down the top 10 summer activities to enjoy with your furry friend. At number 10, we have a beach day. Picture this, the sun is shining, the waves are gently lapping against the shore, and you're spending quality time with your four-legged best friend. There's nothing quite like a day at the beach to make your summer memorable. But before you hit the sand, be sure to check if dogs are allowed on your local beach. It's also a good idea to follow any leash rules to ensure your furry friend stays safe and doesn't disturb other beachgoers. Don't forget to pack plenty of water for both of you. Hydration is key, especially under the summer sun. And if you can, try to visit in the morning or evening to avoid the hottest part of the day. Your dog will thank you for it. After all, a beach day with your best friend is a day well spent. Coming in at number three is the game Bob for Kibble. It's a canine friendly version of apple bobbing that not only cools down your furry friend, but also keeps them entertained. Setting up is as easy as pie. All you need is a kiddie pool and your dog's favorite kibble. Fill up the pool with water and scatter a handful of kibble pieces on the surface. Then invite your dog to dive in. Remember, not all dogs take to water naturally, so be patient and let them figure out how to retrieve the treats at their own pace. This game is an excellent way to encourage your dog to become comfortable with water and it's a surefire way to beat the heat on those scorching summer days. So, next time you're looking for a fun and refreshing activity on a hot day, remember, Bob for Kibble is a fun and refreshing game for your dogs. Number eight on our list is building an agility course. Agility training is not only a fun way to burn some energy, but it also offers a fantastic workout for your dog's mind. It can help improve their coordination, increase endurance, and even boost their confidence. Now, let's talk about how to build a DIY agility course. You don't need fancy gear or a big budget. Common household items or spare materials can be repurposed into excellent obstacles. For example, a broomstick balanced on two buckets can make a perfect jump. A large cardboard box with both ends open can act as a tunnel. And for weave poles, you can use anything from garden stakes to PVC pipes. Remember, when you're introducing your dog to the course, start with one obstacle at a time. Patience and positive reinforcement are key. Before you know it, your furry friend will be tackling the full course with gusto. An agility course is a great way to keep your dog active and engaged. At number seven, we have creating paw art. Unleash both your and your dog's inner Picasso with this fun and engaging activity. Start off by setting up a canvas or a large piece of paper in an area that's easy to clean. You'll want to use dog safe paint, of course, because we want our furry friends to have fun without any risk. Now here's the exciting part. Let your dog step into the paint and then onto the canvas. Guide them if needed, but let them take the lead. This is about them expressing themselves after all. Don't forget to reward your pup with treats for their artistic efforts. And hey, why not join in? Have a finger painting session alongside your dog. It's an excellent opportunity to bond and create a unique memory together. To wrap up, Paw art 
is a creative and bonding activity for you and your dog. It's all about having fun and creating something that you'll cherish. Number six on our list is going hiking. This activity is not only a wonderful way to stay in shape, but it also provides an excellent opportunity for both you and your furry friend to explore and appreciate the beauty of nature. When selecting a trail, it's vital to ensure it's dog friendly. Some trails may have restrictions, so it's always a good idea to check in advance. Now let's talk about the essentials. Always carry plenty of water for both you and your dog. A leash is also a must have, not only for your dog's safety, but also to respect other hikers on the trail. Don't forget the waste bags. We want to leave the trails as clean as we found them. Hiking is more than just a fun activity. It's a bonding experience. It's about sharing an adventure, creating memories, and enjoying each other's company. Hiking is a great way to explore the outdoors with your dog. Coming in at number five is having a pet portrait session. Now, who doesn't love a good photo op, especially when it involves our furry friends? Picture this, your playful pup, a stunning outdoor backdrop, and a camera to capture the moment. It's a recipe for a heartwarming pet portrait. Taking photos of your dog in a natural setting not only adds charm to the shoot, but also gives your dog the freedom to be themselves. You can capture their curiosity, their playfulness, and the joy they find in the simplest things, like chasing a butterfly or rolling in the grass. For the best shots, consider the lighting. Early morning or late afternoon, offer a softer, more flattering light. Don't forget to bring their favorite treats or toys to keep their attention. And remember, patience is key. Let your dog explore and be themselves, and you're sure to capture some precious moments. A pet portrait session is a great way to capture your dog's summer spirit. Number four on our list is making frozen dog treats. A dog's joy is contagious, and there's nothing quite like watching your furry friend savor a chili treat on a warm summer day. Frozen treats are not only a fun surprise for your pup, but they also provide a refreshing escape from the heat. How about trying some simple recipes? One of the easiest involves just two ingredients, plain yogurt and blueberries. Fill an ice cube tray with yogurt, drop a blueberry into each compartment and freeze. Voila, you got a tasty and healthy treat that your dog will love. Or for a more savory option, consider freezing peanut butter. Just remember to choose a brand that doesn't contain xylitol, which can be harmful to dogs. Whatever recipe you choose, the process of making these treats can be as enjoyable as watching your pooch devour them. So, why not give it a try? Frozen treats are a cool way to reward your dog during the hot summer days. At number three, we have enjoying a picnic. As the warmth of summer beckons, what could be more delightful than a picnic with your beloved canine companion? To prepare, pack a basket with dog-friendly treats and a bowl for water. Don't forget to include a few of your dog's favorite toys for a quick game of fetch. Choosing the perfect spot is key. Find a shady area under a tree that provides protection from the hot sun. This ensures your picnic remains a pleasant experience for both you and your furry friend. Now, for the ultimate in comfort, bring along a cozy blanket. This helps to create a soft spot for your dog to rest. And it's also great for you to lounge on as you enjoy your picnic spread. A picnic is not just about the food. It's also about the experience. So relax, soak up the sun, 
and relish this time spent together. A picnic is a relaxing way to spend a sunny afternoon with your dog. Number two on our list is taking a dog training class. Dog training classes are a fantastic way to bond with your furry friend while also instilling a sense of discipline and obedience. Not only does it provide your dog with a fun and interactive environment, but it also challenges their mental faculties, which is as important as physical exercise. Choosing the right class, however, is crucial. Look for classes that use positive reinforcement strategies rather than punishment-based tactics. You want your dog to associate learning with fun not fear. It's also important to find a class that aligns with your dog's age and skill level. A puppy won't benefit as much from an advanced agility class, just as an older dog might struggle in a high-energy puppy class. Finally, remember that consistency is key. Regular attendance and practice at home will ensure your dog gets the most out of the class. A dog training class is a great way to stimulate your dog's mind and reinforce good behaviors. And the number one activity to do with your dog this summer is building a backyard agility course. This activity is not just about fun and games, though it certainly is a joyous way to spend a sunny afternoon. A backyard agility course can help your canine companion stay fit, agile, and mentally sharp. It's also a fantastic opportunity to strengthen your bond with your dog. Setting up an agility course can be simpler than you might think. You can create jumps with spare planks and bricks, or even stake up some old books. For the tunnels, a children's play tunnel or a large cardboard box with both ends open will do just fine. And for the weave poles, you can use garden stakes or even broom handles stuck into the ground. Remember to introduce each obstacle one at a time with lots of positive reinforcement. Soon, you'll have your dog weaving through the poles, jumping over hurdles and zipping through tunnels like a pro. Building a backyard agility course is not only fun, but it also provides a great workout for your dog that wraps up our countdown of the top 10 summer activities to enjoy with your dog. From beach days to bobbing for kibble, building agility courses to creating paw art, there's something to keep every tail wagging. Don't forget your hiking boots, camera, and picnic basket, or the frozen treats to cool down. But remember, Safety comes first. Keep your pup hydrated and follow all guidelines. Have a fantastic summer with your dog and don't forget to try out these fun activities. Until next time, take care.